Hello all. Now this is going to be a really quick video on how to remove line breaks from a MS Word document. Now uh, it's an extension to a blog post I made in my blog AGZ Universe, so you might want to check that out. Um, it's this post. Um, I shall get to the website remove line breaks later on in this video. So um, you can occasionally come across um, files and uh, Word documents that are very poorly formatted. And more often than not, I mean, this is not really a thing that you come across every day, the line breaking problem, but you can occasionally come across poorly formatted documents that, uh, in which especially some people have the habit of uh, breaking a line by hitting the enter key instead of letting the, letting the line run up all the way to the margin and then making the program automatically break it to the next line. So anyways, let's just say I have a very uh, poorly formatted uh, text. I think I should just take some um, song lyrics, I guess, um, which song shall be? Um, That'll do. The Google Doodle on Euros is really good. Yeah. Right. My name is a bit slow, but there you go. So I'm just gonna copy the lyrics of one of the best songs of the past year. I'm gonna hit copy and I'm gonna hit paste. This contains line breaks at the end of every line. Now, this is the proper way to format a, a song lyric, but Let's just say that you don't want these line breaks to be there. You don't want them to be replaced by some other characters. So, uh, so what you need to do is hit Ctrl plus H or you can just go to replace here in the right corner of the word bar. And that should bring up the uh, find and replace box like this. And you need to enter what, what to find and what to replace it with. So usually it's supposed to replace words that have been incorrectly spelled repeatedly in document and stuff, but you can use um, caret the uh, shift plus uh, six should bring up that character that's used for uh, powers in programming use it's called the caret key and p which stands for paragraph break and then you just have to replace it with whatever you wanted to so in my case i'm gonna go for space and and there you go all rhyme breaks have been completely removed and now it's just a continuous paragraph that's more or less it for this topic of removing rhyme breaks from wordpad now if you're curious you can do this in a different way, so it's called, it's basically what's mentioned in this blog post, uh, removelinebreaks.com, so let's go to the website, removelinebreaks.net, actually not .com. Um, you just need to paste your text right here, I, so I have the uh, song lyrics on my clipboard, so I'm going to paste it right here, and convert line breaks to space, convert paragraphs to indent, remove line breaks, and the text gets processed, and it is placed, and it is displayed right here. This is actually even better than the previous one because it converts paragraphs into intent instead of completely you know, collapsing everything together. So if you want to actually remove line breaks, I would recommend using this tool over the MS Word method. But yeah, that's about it. And if you're curious about the uh, caret P operator use, it is a uh, part of something called the control codes of MS Office. And I have left this link in the description. It's the article 95474 in microsoftsupport.com. It just gives you a list of all the uh, operators, the uh, control codes right here, which can be used to um, several purposes. So we place line breaks, white spaces, and a few other characters of um, things. It basically, it allows you to find and replace a lot of things, a lot of the uh, you know, non printed out characters and things, and it can come in handy for you. So I have left this link in the description, and yeah, that's about it for this video. So for more videos like this, subscribe to my channel, hit that button right below and check out my blog agguniverse.blogspot.in for posts regarding technical stuff and other things and hit like if you found this video useful and yeah well since the uh, Copa America is going on and the Euro is starting to tonight and stuff it's gonna be a good weekend I guess for most people so yeah have a great weekend thanks for watching.